what's going on youtube come back at you with another video okay so the breakfast club now has officially responded to these allegations that were made against charlemagne people have been waiting for the breakfast club to say something about the whole situation and now you have it i'm gonna let you listen to what they're talking about but at the end of the day you got to remember this dj envy and angela yee were not there they have no idea what really happened if anything happened, they don't know. So um, they can't do anything or say anything other than what has been presented as fact. So and one last thing I want to talk about before I let you watch this clip is a lot of people out there were talking about Charlemagne could be charged with this now and he's going to get charged and all this shit. The reality is this. This case is over and done with as far as from a criminal standpoint, it's over. There is no coming back and charging him. Um, once the prosecution enters into a plea deal with the defendant, it's over. There is no more coming back. So as far as Charlemagne being charged for rape, uh, yes, yeah, highly unlikely that anything like that is going to happen, but it is what it is. Let me know what you guys think about this whole situation though. Um, I definitely appreciate you watching. If you haven't subscribed to my channel already, please go ahead and do so. Peace. Okay, Yes, this story is close to home as it involves one of our hosts on The Breakfast Club. And we've been waiting for all of the information to come out before we could report it. But it has been announced that there was a 17-year-old rape case against Leonard McKelvey, a.k.a. Charlemagne. And that case will not be reopened. Now, he was arrested back in 2001 on suspicion of raping a 15-year-old girl. Back in 2002, Leonard McKelvey made a plea agreement. And he pleaded guilty to the lesser charge of contributing to the delinquency of a minor. The rape charge was dismissed. And that case cannot be reopened. Now, according to the uh, prosecutor, South Carolina law is clear that once a defendant enters plea negotiations and a plea agreement is accepted by the court, due process requires the state to honor the agreement. The state's prosecution has ended, and the dismissed charge against Mr. McKelvey will not be resurrected. And I cooperated with authorities. Yes. We participated in some multiple interviews and submitted the DNA test. Right. The sexual assault charge was dismissed. Now, uh, Charlemagne, aka Leonard McKelvey's attorney, said he never had sexual relations or any physical contact with the accuser and even provided dna to prove it so that's the situation with that i know a lot of people were waiting for us to speak on it and there's all the facts of what we know